What's going on everyone? I'm gonna show you the quick and dirty way on how to level your alt with eye level. And so I'm at 592 and I don't really have much I can do right now. But in order to level your alt, I would say try and kind of match these uh, to get similar results. So I have 11, 12, 13, and 12. Uh, the major things that you're trying to shoot for are both your carved crests and your uh, trinkets that are epic or your helm that's epic, your shoulders that are epic, your neck that's epic, and your chest. Um, all of those are from rep. And then also your uh, uh, trinket here. You could also buy two trinkets from the Dark Moon Fair, but I'm gonna actually just show you because I have a alt. Um, and I'm gonna see what we can do. So let's uh, let's actually get into it. So right off the bat, uh, with a new alt, I didn't know this, but you can get all of your quests from the uh, rewards from the renowned. So that's pretty sweet. Uh, also, I do need to buy shoulders. So I think this is rank six or seven or eight renowned, and so I just need to add 1600. A little of these, I think it's memories, and boom. And so we have. So the next one, I will get my shoulders, which I already, or my helm, which I already have. Uh, I've I bought that earlier, and so uh, I will just keep transferring my res Renaissance crystals from my main account. And so this vendor, again, similar renown is like six, seven, or eight. Uh, is right here. It's just all of the the renown vendors are labeled you can see them very very easily so like this one's right here with this little castle and then this little castle right here and so um, we're gonna just gonna grab all of those and make sure we get those that gear first and then finally I'm gonna go get my chest which is in the renowned vendor in uh, hollow fall uh, right here just uh, open this up and get this I am missing a neck and a trinket I do know the trinket comes from uh, the spider zone. Um, let me find the, the neck real quick. To get the neck, you'll need to do the quest, Those Who Fell, uh, and go through this quest line to get a, uh, I think it's a 589 neck. I'm gonna do that now. So once you finish that quest, it will give you this 571, and you just turn that in. Then you're gonna wanna start this quest to get your 589 necklace. The character is Rain. Uh, located in Hammerfall, uh, just south of where you turned in that quest. I'm also gonna buy my Nerubian Pheromone Scepter. So you are going to want to swap your resident crystals for some cash and buy your trinket. Uh, that's gonna be a 589 item. And then do that quest Flame Within. Uh, all of that should get you uh, pretty pretty good here. Epic, 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 uh, and epic trinket. You can also buy a trinket on the auction house. And so those trinkets are Symbiosis, uh, Vivacity, Radiance, and Ascension. And you can buy all any of them. They're really inexpensive. So that leaves you with a few options. You can run Heroics until you hit seven, uh, 571 on this gear, this gear, this gear this gear, your rings, your weapon, and bracers. You can kind of grind out some of the rep uh, to, I believe, 16 uh, in order to get uh, belt, boots, and I believe wrists. So you will still need gloves and uh, rings, and that's about it. Uh, as far as, since you've already have all sorts of uh, renowned, I would def not renowned. Uh, yeah, renowned. Y you got all sorts of these carved harbingers and weathered harbingers, so you can upgrade your gear. Uh, also, I highly recommend it to do all of the the world quests and the um, weeklies because it's going to help out quite a bit with your gear and. Uh, really just help you level a lot uh, with your um, eye level. I'm not gonna play this character that much, so I'm just gonna level it all the way up um, 
because I don't, I don't even know what the, the main stats are for my character uh, for the shaman. Uh, also, I could go and do keys for bountiful devs uh, or hold them off until tomorrow or a couple days, but there is a chance for a higher rep that, uh, that drops. So uh, you could definitely get that. So all in all, you're getting quite a bit of upgrades. Um, like if I take this here. So, so really you want to boost your eye level uh, as far as you can get it. So you can get on the right track with a veteran. Uh, veteran obviously uses carved versus heroic gear. Uh, or adventure gear goes up to f uh, 589 and those are used for harbingers and valor stones so i wouldn't really use really as of tomorrow tuesday uh you won't really ever use harbingers because you won't ever go back to heroic uh so i would just uh you know if for me, I'm not going to boost my characters up that much. I mean, this is enough for gathering uh, for what I do. I mean, that's all it does is a gatherer. So uh, I'm not going to go hard in the paint, but those are some easy ways you can get your gear up to some nice eye level, uh, like 584 for the helm, chest 584, I mean, 606 shoulders. Um, so definitely decide your route. But that is an easy way to gear your character uh, with doing very minimal work. Uh, I am going to be doing more videos on me gearing through uh, Delves level tier 8 and Mythics tier 8. So I will keep uh, you guys up to date. But um, I will be on my Druid who is the... Um, what 593 right now i think i'm sitting at uh with a different trinket i'm using a blue trinket right now because it's just so good with stats um oh, what the fuck what happened what is going on I'm just gonna let them fight and then pick up the free honor here in a second. But uh, yeah, 392 app, I'm using a uh, 580 instead of my uh, 584. So, uh, how long is this gonna take? All right, uh, I'm gonna probably cut it here, uh, but I will be raiding tomorrow, uh, on r rather Thursday. Uh, as you can see, I am capped on a lot of this stuff. Even Valor Stones, like I can't use anything for Valor Stones besides level up Pop and Shock. So that's probably what I'll do with all of their gear. Um, but that's it. Hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll see you guys on the next one.